Hello guys, welcome back again. This is Suresh from Automation channel. Today in this session, we will see about how we can install the JMeter into Windows operating system. In the last session, we have seen about introduction towards the JMeter and its features. So if you are new to this session, do watch that earlier session so that you will understand this session. So let's get started. Uh, let me first check whether Java is installed in my system or not. For that, uh, you have to open the command prompt and uh, just type uh, java hyphen version so if you see the version number then uh, java is con correctly configured in your system and if it is not configured i will share the link of tutorial about uh, installation of java in the windows operating system uh, you can watch and uh, install the java so once you install this java you have to configure the at the build path also so i have uh, provided that information in the same session so you can follow that so once you set up the path of java then simply type uh, java c so that uh, we can see our compiler is correctly configured so if you see this logs then your compiler is correctly configured okay now next thing is we have to get the jmeter to be downloaded so from where we can download that jmeter so to download jmeter open any browser and just type uh, jmeter download so this is offered by apache jmeter so you can go here this is the first link you can click on this link and uh, you will be landing on this page of downloads apache jmeter and uh, if you see here there is a binaries file and the source file so you can download the binary file which is of uh, zip type so on the windows operating system you can uh, zip uh, download the zip file and unzip and you can start use it so i have downloaded this file uh, which will be in my local let me open it so this is a zip file so i will right click and uh, extract all files i will extract all files uh, here only uh, in the c drive right this is a c drive i will extract all my files in the c drive so it is extracting the files right it has extracted all files here you can see apache jmeter 5.6.3 so open this folder and in the bin folder you have to go to the apache jmeter folder under that you have to go to the bin folder under that you will see the the batch file of this jmeter so you can see jmeter batch file so this is a batch file with the only jmeter so just double click on it it will give you some initial logs later it will load the jmeter so this is successfully downloaded and it has installed and it has opened our graphical user interface so it is very simple right no need to do any installation you can right away just open that batch file it will open the jmeter so this is a jmeter ui so we'll uh, discuss more on this jmeter ui in the upcoming session and i can do one thing i can do a quick uh, launch of this jmeter so here i have just jmeter batch file right i can right click and uh, i can do a a shortcut creation of this shortcut so let me do go to the show more options and here i will say create a shortcut so it will be created somewhere in this same folder so this is a shortcut right so i will do one thing i will remove the shortcut from this location and i will paste on my desktop so from here using this shortcut also you can open your jmeter so you will be seeing now two instances one is uh, already open another one is open from this desktop so this is the two ways that you can open the jmeter all right we'll see more in detail in the upcoming session so do stay tuned for the, all the updates and if you have any questions queries about the installation of jmeter and if it's stuck anywhere and you have questions to open this file and you have uh, some error facing so let me know i will help you out if the session is helpful, do post a like and share with a colleague. Thank you for watching.